Hey, what's up, ladies and gentlemen? This is Chris, the random blind guy. Here from Hot Wheels, I got the tuned twin mail. You either love it or hate it when it comes to this casting. Very exaggerated. Apple green, awesome rims, nice roller. Anything that's twin mail related, I like it. Oh yeah, very, very cool. I think those are engines, right? So getting out the frame. There's the driver's side. There's so many twin mills out there, guys. It's hard to keep up. It's like the regular one. There's like the Gen 2, Gen 3. Don't quote me, but there's just so many versions of this thing. It's re it, it is, it's hard to... <laughs> there's the one without the motors. There's the ones with the motors. There's a... Yeah. There's... I did a video... I'm mentioning all the different variants of the twin mill. And I actually don't remember what I even said on that video, but uh, I must have done my research on <laughs> prior. But uh, but yeah, I love the twin mill. Whether it whether it whether it's the <laughs> can't even fucking talk. The Braille Racer one or whether it's the one with the no motor. To be honest with you, the, my favorite, favorite one, y'all would think it's the Braille one, right? It is. It's kind of is. But the, my favorite, favorite one out of all the twin mills is the one with the, with just the flat hood. It's just a flat, no motor, no nothing. Just regular. It's just a twin mill and it's just a flat hood, flat surface. So thank you for tuning in. It's Chris, the random blind guy, and this is the tuned twin twin mail and, and uh i uh one of my favorite castings metal body plastic base not that heavy but it's an awesome toy awesome casting and when you think about the word toy it's like it's it's you would think it's cheap and it's for kids and blah blah, blah. but this is a really cool uh toy in the sense where it, it actually feels like a toy well i mean it is a toy but it actually feels it, it just has that vibe right you know it just has that cool vibe like something that you would get out of a like you know one of those little machines those one of those machines called where you get the little stuffed animals this is something that you would you would get out of those machines uh maybe like a puzzle ball or something as well in that machine but this is one of those goodies it just brings joy and happiness or whatever as gay as that sounds <laughs> or as cliche as that sounds it just brings joy and happiness to have this in your hand even though to some collectors it might be ugly but uh you know me i try to cover all surfaces and uh just bring you my personal opinion and honest review You have a great one and another hot, miserable day and miserable in terms of the heat, not in terms of life, but in terms of heat, another hot, miserable day with the bullshit Saharan dust. So why should we get their bullshit? How, how does that work? is it is it the jet line stream or what i don't even know what that is but it, it could that be causing the you know the, the african dust to come over here it's just it's kind of annoying i mean how the fuck is it our how does that work same thing with those uh canadian fires i mean how is it everyone else's burden that I mean, that's 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 that sucks that that is even happening but it becomes everybody else's you know issue which is kind of in and of itself you know anyways i'll see you on the next one guys